SlideShare is the world's largest community for sharing presentations, infographics, Word documents, and portfolios. Over 70 million people use SlideShare. There are over 18 million presentations on the platform, and SlideShare itself gets over 159 million page views a month. Yes, a month. And not to mention, it's one of the top 100 most visited websites in the world. So yes, this is a platform that you need to tap into to help market your lead magnet, your course, your business, or any digital content. Here at Teachable, we also have our own SlideShare channel. As you can see, I've designed seven presentations and three infographics. Four out of those seven presentations have been featured on this homepage of SlideShare and one of the infographics. So now I'm going to explain to you how you can use SlideShare to market your lead magnet. The first thing you're going to do is you need to create a SlideShare around your lead magnet. And it's super easy. Just go into PowerPoint or Keynote. And what you're going to do is create a bit of a story around your lead magnet. We kind of did this with a lead magnet we created over here at Teachable called Three Gorgeous Keynote PowerPoint templates. So what I did is I created one created the download and then I created a slide share that starts off as a story saying yes we all love beautifully designed slide shares but it's really hard to do and I want to help you. And so the presentation just kind of goes through that pain and convincing people that this is here to help them. Basically it has a beginning a middle and an end and at the end is a way for oops for a way for the audience to download the templates. And that is essentially what you want to do with your SlideShare. You're gonna use your SlideShare as a way for people to get your link and download it, so that way they're giving you your email address. Here are a couple tips on how to make designing SlideShare super easy. Use bold, beautiful images, whether they're funny, or breathtaking or even can be illustrations whatever whatever you want to use just make sure it falls in with your brand and what you're trying to portray um, and then just use short pieces of text as you kind of can see back here in the beginning it's barely it's half a sentence and I used two slides to make that point keep it short and sweet because SlideShare is meant to be scrolled through really quickly so keep it short and simple and to the point and then once again, link your lead magnet at the end. All you need to do is in SlideShare, or excuse me, in Keynote or PowerPoint when you're creating your presentation, create a square or whatever kind of button that you want to create and then link it. So that way when it's up on SlideShare, people will hover over it and click on it. The one thing you can't do with SlideShare is you cannot include a clickable link within the first three slides. So take that into consideration. And you should also include social sharing links somewhere in the presentation just to get your audience to give it to their network. If they love the presentation, you want them to share it and have their friends love it and share it too. And that's how you get more shares with SlideShare. So I'm going to show you now how to upload a presentation to SlideShare and how you can help improve your rankings for it. What you want to do is click the upload button and it'll take you to this screen. Take a PDF version of your keynote or PowerPoint presentation and drop it here. Right now, the title comes up as a file name. You want to edit that to be something much more keyword focused. So let's just call this four steps to a great presentation. You'll then fill in a description that's also keyword, keyword rich and also tells your audience exactly what they're getting. One other thing you should do in the description is include a link either back to the blog post or a lead magnet in bit.ly form. Just that way it's one other way and one other link that someone can click on and hopefully give you their email address. You'll want to choose the category that best fits your SlideShare deck and then keep it public so everybody can see it. Then what you'll want to do is enter in a bunch of tags that represent your deck, either like online courses or how to create a great presentation, keynote, slide share, PowerPoint, on top of other long tail keywords just to help with Google's search rankings and when people are searching on SlideShare itself. Also, when you're creating your title, you'll want to put your Twitter handle at the end. This way, when people share your presentation, they will, you will get notified on Twitter and it'll just get your name out there one more time. SlideShare automatically pulls a transcript of all the text that is in your deck, which will help once more with your Google ranking and when people are searching for keywords that are included. 
just like any other social platform, start following and liking other content by influencers in your sphere or people who have similar content to you. This way, your name is starting to circulate on their platforms in their content, which hopefully will drive traffic back to you. Because the more active you are on the platform, the higher ranking you'll have within the SlideShare algorithm. Once you have this pres- your presentation uploaded, share it on all your social media channels so your, your network can see what you've been doing. S- share it on Twitter, on Facebook, on LinkedIn. Share it everywhere because the more traffic that will be dri- driven to your slide share means the more email addresses you might get for your lead magnet. Once you create this resource, it will continually to live on without any more work from you. The more people who end up seeing it, the higher rank it'll start to get in search results. If you look here, this presentation was published months ago and it already has this many views. This presentation has this many views and I think I made this in like October or something. I get notifications daily about someone liking this post or this post so once it's done it's done and traffic will keep coming to it and that is one of the best parts about SlideShare.